Have you ever wondered why space is completely silent, even though stars explode and planets collide? Yet light from those stars travels millions of years to reach us? Here's the surprising reason why sound dies in space. But light doesn't. Sound is a vibration. It needs something to push. Air, water, metal. When molecules bump into each other, the vibration travels. But in outer space, there are no molecules close enough to carry these vibrations. In space, the distance between atoms can be the size of a room. With nothing to collide, sound waves simply fade away. So even the loudest explosion in space would make absolutely no sound. But light doesn't need molecules at all. Light is an electromagnetic wave. It carries its own energy. It doesn't rely on atoms to move forward. It can travel through air, glass, water, and even the vacuum of space. Think of light like a self-propagating ripple of electric and magnetic energy. It doesn't need a medium. So sunlight reaches Earth across 150 million kilometers without touching a single air molecule. And here's something surprising. Sound actually can exist in space, but only in certain places. Dense regions like nebulae or gas clouds can carry sound. But it travels much slower, and the pitch is extremely low. When a star explodes in a supernova, the energy is massive. Light reaches us, radiation reaches us, but sound? The space between us and the star is too empty, so the sound never makes it out. That's why sci-fi movies are wrong. In real space, spaceship battles, laser shots, and explosions would be completely silent. You'd see everything, but hear nothing. To summarize, sound needs atoms. Space is almost empty. Light is electromagnetic. It travels perfectly through a vacuum. And that's why the universe is full of light, but silent. If you enjoyed this short science explanation, follow for more videos that make you smarter every day.